Hello, I'm back again today for part seven of our um, Christmas thoughts journal. And um, I finished making the um, little, I'm gonna set this to the side, making the little, um, oh, what do you call it? Paperclip, uh, altar paperclip with the little ticket things inside. So uh, the next thing I'm looking at i just move this over to the side a little here. Um, don't need that one. This is Cogs. Oh, I forgot to look up uh, to see who that was that um, made those other little digitals. Anyway, everything is in my link, so you should be able to find whatever it is that you are looking for. All right. Um, so we've got this little guy here and I've got this little picture there. I'm just going to go through real quick and see, um, I guess, I don't know that we're going to put something on every page. Um, it just gets to be, um, so much, uh, if we do every page, let me see if I had another pocket. I don't see one handy. All right. I thought I had another. I try to put everything sep Well, I guess, no, that's not really a pocket, but that, this is a journal card. Maybe I did already put all the pockets in that I had. So I may have to make some more pockets. Okay. I can always do that. This one we glued down this page and left this open to put something up inside of there to cover uh, the back of this, which I think that turned out really cute. So then we have this little um, pocket here, this little pocket with the journal card in it. Uh, this one is just plain. Just a cutesy little page and you can write a little journal message along here you know anywhere really okay now I have this belly band I put in here I've got to figure out what I want to put in there I thought I'd have more journal cards um, I may take these and cut them in half and make a journal card with them okay come back to that um, Possible pocket there. Okay, this guy, I want to put the journal cards in like this, the bigger ones. So, um, I suppose we need to decorate these. Uh, this one, I have this little girl on here. And so I'm thinking maybe um, we don't really need to do... A lot of decorating on her on this one because she's already ready to go so something like this would be fine just um, just a little something I kind of like this one um, I have this one doesn't look as um, dainty as this does and I think I can slide that down in there without a problem. Um, yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. That looks pretty busy on there. Let's see. Okay, there, actually. Yeah, too big. I 
All right, I think, I, I think I'm just gonna put this on there, the fabric tack. And I'll try to put it closer to the outside edges so that it doesn't um, get all wrinkled up inside. Let's see in the middle. These are the ones that I slow stitched. I think it looks good. It's got the pinks on it and everything. Oh, my back is um, a little sore today. I don't know what I did. I was painting. So I'm trying to see how long I will last. I wanted to get some other sewing done, too. I want to just work on my grandson's quilt. Okay, I'm just having a little coffee to give me a... All right, let me go to the other side of this, this one. And we didn't do anything to the front of this yet. So much work to do. I wanna put this in here. I guess I don't know which way up I want it yet. But um, I thought on this one, I might be able to use one of these larger images I don't know that one kind of works because it's outlined with a darker color um, see those just kind of blend right in um, these two, I think I used them somewhere else, but I don't remember where. There's my other little pocket. I was going to put it on this page. And I have one to go on the other side of that. Let's see, where's that page? When I look back on these videos, I'm, I can see where I, I passed it a couple times. There it is. So I think I was going to put a pocket here and a pocket here. And so I think I just need to make some more pockets um, for those other pages. All right, back to this. Hmm. Now, let's see. Let's see what she looks like. Cause she covers a big part of the page. I like that one. And maybe um, something up here. I like that one. Get a little inking on the edge. You don't want these to be too thick anyway because you know it's for journaling on the back so you don't want them to be too cumbersome in the front oh glue book you're gonna need something else so let me get another one something up there if we choose to I have to okay Let's see what so the little flowers show up so maybe something up in this corner how about just this little ruffle not the whole ruffle just part of it I have also this little 
Hmm. Doesn't show up that well. Let me see if I have any other apples. up those roses and actually this one does too kind of let's see kind of covers up those roses I was thinking I could just make it a tab over to the side Okay, let me see if I have any other something here. That's the same color. Darn. Must have did those all in one day, huh? Just looking in my ruffle box. Hold on. Or my um, yeah, let's see. Just, um, right. Um, don't see one. So it's either that or nothing. I think I'm just going to put it up here on the edge. And that'll kind of make it a tab. Let's see if I can rip this a little bit. I'll glue it out to here and then I will cut that off because I don't like that one end the way it looks. Okay, so start the glue about right there. All right. Okay, I like that. All right, this one I still have to sew around. Whoops, I'm stuck in there. Um, okay, what do we want to do here? Um, maybe a corner pocket right here and a torn pocket and then put a tag see. I am out of papers again I tell you I just keep running out of paper I just you know I feel like I need to print a whole lot more um,
I don't know how this will look, but if I have to, I'll go print more stuff. there like that. I wonder if I need to maybe go up on this end a little more. Okay, and then I will just put a journal card I mean, a tag right there. I like that. Okay, that works. So let me get this glue. I'll go around these sides here. I always like these ripped corner pockets. I don't know why. I just, other than just the plain old straight ones. is still wet after a couple hours or maybe it hasn't been a couple maybe just um, almost an hour and a half okay so that's that and I love this I don't know this is uh, from it was like a freebie or something but I think she looks really pretty with this journal they just look like Chris they're ready for Christmas okay and then um, I could put a tag, I mean, a ribbon up there, or I could just leave it. Hmm. Don't want to put a ribbon. Actually, I have two of these, so why don't I just do one with a ribbon, and then I can decide. And I buried, um, <laughs> I, I've got to clean up. I've got to clean up. I'm going to put an eyelet in it because I just think they look nice. Okay, so I have, let's see, I thought I pulled out some different ribbon. This is, would be nice if I had rolled this up. Um, let's see if I can, I don't know what I did with it now. There it is. I don't know if I, I like this. I'll, I'll tie it on there and see. It's um, satin ribbon, but it's really, really stiff satin. And I avocado dyed it. I think. Avocado dyed it. It's probably avocado. All right. Okay, I had a little interruption, but I'm back now. So, where was I? Okay, we're gonna put this tag right there. I think I'll just leave that ribbon on there right now. And um, let me go back here. And I've got this guy there. And we have this other gold page. I don't know yet what to do with that. Okay, I have this little girl here. I was just gonna put some of these on, you know, just um, on the blank pages. Some of these images that I had. 
yeah, see like right there, it's a journal page, but that kind of adds a little bit to it. Um, let me ink this up a little. One thing about these, I can always print more. And they're fun to cut out. I love cutting out. It's like paper dolls. Uh, now my timer is probably gonna go off because I set my timer. I don't know what time it was when I started. like that little extra that it gives. This would be pretty on the gold up here. But I feel like I need something because it's not very usable. I was trying to think what I could do with um, some gold um, embossing powder. Maybe I could do something. I have this card too. I was going to put this somewhere, though. All right. Let me think about that one. And this little angel I can put down here on this journal page. And she looks cute on that journal page, too. Um, yes, no, yes. I don't know. Um, that's not a journal page, so you can't you know, kind of like her on here. This was, I was going to do this at the last, you know, the empty pages, but I'm just going to go ahead and do it now. to put her on the cover but didn't get to do that got this bird I love this bird too all right oh this one it, it's a tag let's do this tag here and then I want to put something on this one let's see that we've got this red Hmm. Needs to be a tall, skinny one. The oh, green. I can't find a spot for her because of that blue coat. It, it just can't get it. And the angel, that's too plain for there, but I want to use hers. She's so pretty. This one might be the best one for here. The uh, length, oh, yeah, he's too big. Oh no, I don't think he's too big. And actually, he's kind of cute with this little green sticking out and the green from there. I like that one. So, um, we're supposed to get tomorrow morning, I think, some of that hurricane storm. We have a flash flood warning. So if you're if you're living down there in this, I guess it's probably in coming up through Mexico area, the Gulf. I haven't really watched the news that much because I've been watching the uh, news. Um, I've been watching the uh, fire news. And I didn't hear anything about the hurricane because in Los Angeles is probably not a problem. So.
sometimes that glue dries so fast. It doesn't give you time to get your little things down. Come on. There you go. All right. So that's that and that's that. And I kind of wished I had sewed down this before I put it in, but I didn't. Okay, and this one gets a tag or something in that pocket. I'm not sure what yet. That's pretty with that. So I'm just going to set that in there. I don't know if I'll put ribbon on it or not. I mean, I probably will. I just don't know what ribbon. Okay. So, you know, we're getting there. We are getting there. So let me show you this book over here, how I did this. I, and I have this on another video, the first Christmas journal I made. Um, if you look at my uh, playlist, it'll say Christmas journals, and it's in there. So um, on how I did it. Although I did this one a little different because, I don't know, I cut it out differently or something. So I think these two pages she printed together and then this page was separate and this page was together. So that's that's what happened. And then, so I had to seam this page to, uh, to these two in the middle there for the numbers to come out right. So um, now what I'm going to do, this one will make a cover. So these two get glued together. So that gets glued to there. Okay. And then, so that makes one page there, one page there on this side and then this gets glued to this back let me get my book she has a lot of kids children Beatrice Trevor Todd Nick Sam Victoria Vanessa Max and Zara huh I think that's Danielle Steele one of her books no, she had that many kids. I don't usually read her books anyway, but these are from the thrift store. So I buy them at the thrift store and then I paint them and then I put um, lettering on the side and make it. I'd have to show it to you. I don't know if I've ever showed those on my videos. Okay. So there we go with that. white showing up in there. It's not the perfect way to do it, but it's the only way I could figure it out to work to make this little book. Okay, so now now I need a cover. So what do I want to do? I've got these pieces here. Oh, I have this winter menu too. I need to sew that. Yes, I don't. Yeah, too bad that didn't fit. I would just put it on there. Um not big enough. These all fell out. This 
looks Christmassy. Double-sided, too, but I don't need that. All right. This is Artie Mae's, her paper. I'm trying to think what kit it was in. I don't remember. I use it a lot. I don't know, I have a thing for, for, for red anyway. All right, let me trim this up. I make my own tangled web. Maybe I should glue it on, then trim it. Let me glue it on first. So I hear that next weekend, the time changes. So I don't look forward to that because I don't like dark early. I like it to stay daylight longer. For one, it's driving. I don't like driving at night. So I can't be out as late as I am in the summertime. Okay, so I think I already inked that, but then I cut some off, so let's just do a real quick inking again. Now, what to put on the front. I wished I had something that said calendar on it. Um, Christmas or December or, don't I have anything that says December somewhere? Um, Something should. Kind of running out of um, collages and pockets. Oh, that's all. That fits. Happy holidays. Um, This is going to slide into a pocket. There's something about this one that I, maybe going that direction looks all right. I'm trying to think if I put it in a pocket. Um, will that be too bulky? Um, I don't want it in that pocket because that's too collagey right there. Probably could put it something like that. Oops. 
something like that. I guess I could stick it pretty much in a few places. Yeah, that wouldn't be a problem stuck in there. So, all right, I kind of like this one. It um, matches the same. I'm going to put this green. Um, I'm going to put this on with um, glue stick and a little um, fabric tech because um, it's wrinkled. And that will just, um, I mean, it doesn't need much, just so it doesn't fall off. Because I don't know if it would fall off. Oop. Fabric. Okay. Let me put this on with fabric tech. It's a little, um, a little thick, a little heavy, I should say. Somebody's mowing their lawn. I thought all that was over with. Maybe not. All righty. Now, I wished I had a word that said, you know, um, that was just, I don't know, you know, they, they didn't do any words that are just Christmas. I guess it's already got these words anyway. So I guess that's that's going to be it. Just this. And then when they open it, they'll see what it is. The calendar. And I'll try to put that close to the front of the book. I think I'm just going to stick this in here for now. Then to come back and put so around it. Did this little blue girl. I don't know where I got all these extra ones. I don't remember cutting all those extra. Okay, so, and I've got all these tags that I will just, um, you know, put within here and there. Let's see, where does that... And we've got this. I think maybe, I don't know where I was going to put this, but I think I'm going to put it right here now. Maybe I should put a tab on that right there. Let me see if I have any tabs that are um, already made. would go with it. I've got this one. It's green music. That one is um, something wrong. It was a mistake, evidently. I don't even want that. Um, oh, here's another fabric one, but I pretty close to that fabric one so no let's see a 
it's funny how you get all of these and the, then when you need one you don't have anything the color you need like this um kind of goes with that bird okay i have no idea how much time well my timer hasn't gone off so i mean my phone went off but that doesn't mean my timer went off so that's good I'm just going to get this part. I'm sorry, I'm off screen. My book was sitting here in the way. I'm not sure where this um, digital came from either. I don't think it's Artie Mays. I don't think it was in that first Christmas one I did. I think it was just on my computer, like one of those freebies. And you know, when you download things, um, it doesn't tell you where you got it from has the file name, but it doesn't, you know, say who f gave it to you for free. At least my computer doesn't. It's very frustrating, even to find anything. Okay, so we've got that there, and I didn't leave that one open, so that's good right there. Okay, um, let's see here. I feel like those ties are a little long. I hope those don't unravel too much. I'm not sure quite how to stop them. I guess I could dip them in glue or something. Okay. Um, I have somewhere. I have this belt. Oh, maybe that's what I was going to put there, but... See. Let's put one of these tags. These kind of have to, they need a thing at the top. That's what I did with those guys. I put them on that. Well, they're twice, but they're very cute, so they're going to like having them twice anyway. Um, I don't want to hide this hurt too much. I might just take a plain paper and put... Um, back there but you know there's journaling room across here journal up here I think I need to keep one of these for myself so I can journal in all these cute little spots okay this guy I want to put this one right there what I want to do. Yeah. I felt like this page could be journaled on, but there's the timer. 
Okay, so now it has been an hour. And I combine these two together. Um, I think I have time to do one more on this side. Maybe that's that pink. It's not that far away. Okay, let me glue this one down. I think it's already caught. This kind of sits over that tag, but I think it's okay. So I may glue a few more of these little um, embellishments on the pages like this. I think that adds a lot to just a plain old journal page. Okay, and then in these pockets I can put some little tags and I will cut those, punch them out, put um, ribbon in there. Come back to where did you go? There. Oh, let's see, she already matches. Boy, I feel like I've seen her everywhere. <laughs> Isn't that funny? All right, let's put that guy there and maybe that color there. Whoops. Um, this little girl, let's see, did I, she's in there too. Well, she's different, see, she's not different. I thought she was the same. A little different. Okay. And a lot of times I like to throw in the leftover tags, um, in the journal anyway, because, you know, people may want to use them for, on the gift bag, gift, um, gifts that they're doing. Let's, I do have this, oh, there's that. Back there, that looks good. Although I do like her, I would like to put her somewhere again. Maybe I'll put her there too. Then this one needs to have punched. We're almost done. So I'm probably gonna come back and do the cover. And then I almost feel like we've got plenty in here. I'll go back, now let's put a couple in this one. I don't like one, just one tag. Those are the same size. Um, back and get oops this guy there I put this one back in here okay I got that guy there maybe I have another tag oh I have I have a couple more over there that I haven't um, sewn And I'll put the ribbons on that. These are all done. And storybook. I feel like I need something up at the height of that page, but and that one's cute with a journal card. I don't know. Usually I put a tab on it, but I don't know. I don't think it needs it. Okay, 
this needs a bigger some something that I'm gonna probably just fold up a piece of paper this needs to be sewn this is a thick part page I need oh that's where I could put that other big tag let's put that Christmas one Oh, that's the one that's okay let's put that up there that way they know that there's a an opening okay a picture I could put that somewhere else too I don't know um, and then something to go in here. What am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something. Mm, I don't know. Let me see what. I have a notebooks. It's kind of nice to put a little notebook in if I have one that matches. That one matches. These have been great. They just, let's see what kind of writing, what tablet. Yeah, that's got just the coffee dye paper. I like that. I like that. I think I'll put a little, that one I just stapled it on. And it's not very strong on there. Add a little more. I need to sit and make a bunch of these little collages again. I do have this little guy left. Um, I know I need to go, right? Just was thinking, where can I? I didn't put anything here. I didn't find anything I liked. I might have to keep looking on that too. I could just stick him on here like that every little bit adds to the character of the book every little bit okay so that's it and I will um, probably be back uh, in the next video and um we'll do the cover and i'll have all those other little stray things done and then i can do a flip through it's now it's getting nice and fluffy i still i think i want to put um lace or something coming out maybe even just on the second page just to kind of um Let's see what that's pretty big. I wasn't thinking that big. Um, well, I'll have to wait and see because I want it to match the cover. I want it to look nice with the cover lace. Okay, so it's getting full. And then I have a couple little charms to add. And we still have quite a bit that we can do. Alrighty, thank you so much and have a great day. Bye.